Alexios, I can tell from the smile on your face, Duris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? It really is the spear of Leonidas. Uh... Thief! I'll rescue your brother, for a price. Yes, yes, of course. Drachmi is the only language you Kefalonians understand. I'm not Kefalonian. I'll see you all at the selection ceremony, ladies. I especially hope you show up. Let me guess. He's rich. Do you often get tied up and surrounded by snakes? How can you joke about this? Thugs broke into my home, dragged me here, tied me up and surrounded me with these hideous creatures. They must be stopped. The snakes? The thugs! Now, if someone can tell me what's going on... This dishonorable girl stole from me! Huh. You call me a thief? You're... They say it's a curse and they need help from the gods. I told you, I'm not a god. But Icarus... ...is a bird. Fuck from one man in all my days! <gasps> Let him go. No one on this island is allowed to say that word! Did he say Cyclops? Did it hurt your feelings? I don't like it when people call me that! Um, oh, I didn't. I... But you're so fat. I mean, big, strong, and really do only have one eye. Oh, my eye. Give it to me. Give it to me, and I won't kill Marcos for having you steal it! Give it to me! You want it? <laughs> Go get it. <laughs> Are you out of your fucking mind? How long till Podarkis finds us? We're right under his nose. His nose is so high in the air, he couldn't find the statue of Art. I thought you might get along. How did... It... There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? Maybe you can see Phidias after his trial, if the people spare his life. It's been so long since Phidias and I have... seen each other. You understand? Don't you? Oh! Oh, come to pay him a last visit before the trial. He's as good as dead, you know. Better make this one count. Is that everything? You're all ready to go in. Don't worry. You've done scarier things than this. I'm struggling to think of any right now. Why, I was just filling my friend Alexios in on the details. He already has a plan to deal with these bandits. He's the silent but deadly type. Gladly, young lady. I'll see to it you get the best pearls and shiny stones. And I wouldn't mind some gooey myself. Yay! Thank you. You're really nice for a big, scary-looking person. We don't want to scare people in there. Well, I should get this back to Supidio's parents before he does anything stupidio. Mistios, at last! Did you find the shield? I did. Now you can protect yourself from... The prophecy. So, you found the thief? Oh, yes. Cut her in half. She won't steal anything from anyone ever again. And what about the blacksmith? Oh, he's very much alive. We did things in the back of his workshop that would make Aphrodite blush. You didn't. This is awful. Mater? Pater? What's wrong? You're safe. The prophecy's broken. Actually, there's something we've been meaning to tell you. Supidio, you were adopted. What? And the poor thing gesticulating like an ape is Trasimachus. If you listen closely, you'll notice he and Socrates are actually arguing the same points. But the wind from his wild gestures deafens him to critique. She said, spring should not wish for winter, as it brings death with it. Such wisdom! I don't understand a word of it. Sostratos, you don't like people mentioning your... You know. My what? Your hair. Or lack of it. Yes. 
Yes. Make your jokes while walking around like one of Phidias' sculptures come to life. Kira, wait! While the two of you compare swords, I'll be at the Temple of Artemis, making an actual plan. I have my own questions for the Pythia. But this line... I'll be an old man by the time I see her. <laughs> a young couple brought you to us. They knew we'd give you a better home. That sword and shield is your inheritance from them. Wait. So the thief... and the blacksmith... are Supidio's birth parents. You killed his mother and fucked his pater. But the prophecy said Pater would scream to the gods in agony. He screamed, but not in agony. <laughs> the gods work fast. I wished someone as beautiful as me were here, and you arrived. It's almost unfair for both of us to be in one place. It will make everyone else feel bad. Then perhaps making choices that affect them. Are we done yet? I can't stay here all day. Of course you can't. It's a luxury few can afford. Even those with the time for it often lack the mental capacity for such things. Okay. Every time we talk, it seems like you're about to sleep with someone. Or want to. Or you've just finished. Read me the note again. Eagle-bearing Mystios. That's you! Ah! You killed Mater and had sex with Pater! Supidio, I had no idea. I can't get the image out of my head. I don't want to see anymore. Ah! I'm blind, Mystios! Are you happy? Alexios, what do you think we should do? Cruel leader of Delos Islands takes money from our pockets and food from our mouths, all to feed his inset... inseti... Insatiable. Yes! His insatiable thirst for power. I'm here to see the Pythia. Only those chosen by the light of Apollo may enter. How does one get chosen? One goes to the back of the line. Probably for the best. Hmm, best for Thelos, best for the Rebellion, or best for you? Yes. Elixir do. Besides, give me oomph. One of your trials is swimming? That's... Uh, this is a scheme to fleece me. <gasps> Mystios! I... that's... How could you even think such a thing? You're a terrible person. I should probably not climb on this. I brought your drugs. I saw Empedocles risk his greatest treasure, running naked through a military camp. It can't be helped. I've been overcome with adventure. I have, in my possession, a Mykenian tablet that leads to a sacred burial site. I'm calling it the Cave of the Oracle. Good for you. Mykenians were known for their elaborate grave sites, full of precious things. How precious. Can I interest you in purchasing some fermented minotaur droppings, or...? Are you really going to try that on me again? I can leave. No, please don't. Someone or something brought you here to me. Yes, my legs did. The why is unimportant. Perhaps he asks the gods to make his drachmi multiply, or to harden his cock. <laughs> I don't care what you think your relationship with her is. She's just using you. I'm her true love. Right. You keep telling yourself that. Nordfish? He must have a long, pointy nose. No. No, he's really good with a sword, and he's really good with a fish, I guess. Remind me what the note said. <clears throat> Eagle bearing me. The short version, please. Monarchies, cruel leader, thirst for power, pay you handsomely, rebellion, people die. What crime has this woman committed? Exactly that. Her crime is that she is a woman. It's news to me that's now a crime. Shouldn't you lock yourself up first then? Get out of here! And don't you go talking to Theoni anymore! Or what? Or I'll... Uh, oh. Wonderful. I'll leave you to... Um... Shere. But first... So you're not the god of getting to the point. The likeness is terrifyingly good, don't you think? 
Terrifying. Yes. Did Zeus give you any special powers? You know, Achilles got invulnerability, and at least the strength of a god. <laughs> if you know the old stories, you know what Zeus is especially good at. They think they know better, but they can't recite a poem to save their lives. Where do I fit into this? You wouldn't happen to be the eagle bearer, would you? Me? Yes, I am. Where do you know justice? Your hair must have been woven by Athena. Your body is like a sculpture made by the masters. And your arms look so strong. Strong enough to... Strong enough to... Strong enough to carry this basket to my husband, Kalibos. Oh, right. The magistrate mentioned you. This is heavy. What's in here? Bricks? Your wife sent me to deliver this package. I think it might be some kind of offering. Zefxo is a good woman. She's gifted me with a basket fit for Dionysos. Earthly pleasures? She made it sound like it was a case of life and death. A deathly hangover, maybe. Boys, we're having a good night. Could someone pass the water skin? Oh, could someone pass my head? I think I left it farther down the beach. Surely this is the after effects of the mushrooms. I remember the chicken coop. I remember the farmer's field. I do not remember building a Trojan horse. I... Horse shit! What are you doing? Told you. Starting a riot. You think I want to be here? I'd rather be in Sparta, fighting or fucking. You couldn't fight or fuck your way out of a grain sack. Come to see the richest man in Achaia, have you? You don't look rich. This must be the pre-trial of accuracy. Hmm? Oh, yes. This is the pre-trial of accurately finding my Malaka's sons. Your sons? This doesn't sound like a trial. Have you tried raising sons? It's perhaps the greatest trial of all. Only by completing the world famous and totally legitimate pre-trial of accurately finding my sons can you proceed and face the Minotaur. How exactly does going for a swim test my ability to slay the Minotaur? Uh, that's how he'll bring glory to Sparta? By winning an event in the Olympics. Not an event, my king. By making sure Sparta wins the entire Olympics. <sighs> Perfect. The name's Democritos. Renowned thinker of thoughts, writer of rights, and questioner of answers. I'm Alexios. And I've never heard of you. If you want me to find your sons, I'll need to know more about them. They're little sheets. Wondrous. Beautiful. But sheets all the same. Not even in here. Ah! Everything you brought was really expensive. So my pattern will probably kill you. I'm sure. Home. Now. My sons, you brought them home. You were right. They are little shits. Looks like I'll have to get wet. Bring these three theorems to me, and I will reward you handsome. So... You get the theorems, and I get the reward. From a man who seems completely disinterested in Drachmi. <laughs> Drachmi is for idiots! I have your Malakas tokens. No more games, no more schemes to rob me of my Drachmi. It's time to slay a Minotaur! Absolutely, Mistios. Uh, no problem. But first, perhaps you'd like to buy back your exquisite, uh, finely crafted trial tokens? This offer will expire in, uh... By the gods! What do you want from the great champion testicles? Can't you see I'm busy? I'm here to take you to the Olympics. Olympics? Fuck yeah! I'm going to be the champion! <laughs> Champion! Cause I'm Testicles! 
Good. Not another Drachmi. Oh, but champion, surely you want something to help you remember the Befka pre-trial? They'll join you when you're ready to, you know, die horrifically. You've come all this way. Join us. <laughs> no, 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 no. I have a very important uh, pottery lesson to attend. So... <clears throat> And I don't know if I'm up to going sailing on your booty. I have something for you. A certain oil. My oil? Oh, I could kiss you. No, you couldn't. The final member of our Minotaur hunting party has arrived. When the beast sees our assembled might, he will moo miserably in fear. Do Minotaurs moo, or...? The Minotaur is a mythical creature. Only someone just as mythical could slay it. You're talking about me, right? Your beauty brings light into the darkness of what has become my life. It's good to see you too, Phidias. Here's your oil. Take it. Oh, just like Mater used to make. Will you rub it on? Gods, no. Get on the boat. To the Olympics! The people need me! Well, we going? Uh, he better fucking win. Perhaps we should courageously flee. Ah! No, no, no! I only ever wanted to be a baker! Brother, wait, there's more glory in beast slaying than in bread making. Ah! Uh, I should check on my brother. The bacon business can be quite fierce, you know. Good luck. Ah, Pefka. Home of heroes. What makes you think you're in trouble now? The other day, I received a skitali and a note. Someone left you a piece of wood and a letter. I can see why you're frightened. <laughs> Whatever lives down here must be a monster. Did the Minotaur just... cough? Alcibiades, I'm surprised you're... wearing clothes. You know, I would like to relax. In my younger days, I was known for my massages. I don't want a massage. Then, what do you want? First, I want you to kiss me. Then, I'll want you to take me somewhere private. Finally, I'll want you to take off all of your clothes. What? Drop all your valuables and flee in terror, M mortal. Leave me your drachme, and you shall be spared. Otherwise, death by hoof awaits you. Should you ever need a personal sparring partner? You? A skinny little Athenian? I'm the champion! Or gonna be... Sparta! <laughs> oh, a pity your brain isn't as big as your muscles. Fear my moo! Fear it? Malaka. I am going to start stabbing until someone tells me what's going on. to the games. Well, I would have been happy to assist if you were in any state to compete. I... likes to be oil. Well, that's obvious. Yeah. You know us. Oh. Come here. Gives us a hug.
Well, it looks like you're the champion now. You are the Minotaur. You are the Minotaur. You are the Minotaur. You are the Minotaur. The last one. What's so special about a stick? It's not just any stick. The Skitali is used by the Spartans to send coded messages. Okay, so let's talk about your stick. Skitali! All right, Skitali. What else goes on apart from the Pankration? There's Javelin, which, of course, you know how that works. The athlete thrusts the long, smooth spear forward. Yes, I know. And then there's the foot races and the horse races. Sweat everywhere. A delight for the eyes and the nose. Thank you. I would like to know what the fates have planned for me. You would? Yes, of course you would. Everyone wants their future told by the great Uzo. Well, what is it? I see great things. Like what? You know, things. And it's going to be sunny tomorrow. Thank you, thank you. Tell your friends. What is it with the Olympics? Everyone's out to make Drachmi. Malaka, my Drachmi! Hey, stop! Thief! Hey, thief! No one's ever won the prize of Pefka. Everyone who's died facing the Minotaur has had their Drachmi go in the vault, growing year by year. And now, a tiny but well-earned portion of it is yours. Thank you for a... a tiny portion. Of course. Less taxes, reasonable operational expenses, and I'll make sure all of it reaches your boat, Mistios. You've earned it. <laughs> Why is he making you steal? For the drachmi, stupid! You should be more polite to adults. Why? What have adults done for me? Fair enough. Do you know Kalipatira? I've seen that one, all right. Always hanging around the athletes' tents. Disgraceful, if you know what I mean. I'm not sure I do. All those young, oiled, rippling bodies gives you shivers, muscles everywhere. Oh, disgusting it is. And her a married woman and all. There's no harm in looking at an attractive man, is there? The show must go on. My Leonidas is right in front of me. What? Me? Me? I'm no one. But you, you're even godlier than Brasidas said you'd be. It should be your statue between these trees. Brasidas? What does he have to do with this? Warrior, he said. Look for the mighty warrior with the broken spear. I added the godly bit. I'm just a traveler. And there's more than one broken spear in the world. And the eagle he mentioned. What eagle? What are you looking for? If we can find out who's manipulating Lagos, there'll be no need for blood. I thought Spartans drank blood for breakfast. <laughs> that was your best? That was but the beginning! What? <clears throat> looking for... You! Stentor? Oh! Oh! Malakas! The crowd loves you, but you're not done yet. Not done? It's as if the Weaver of Wiles herself possessed me. I can hardly resist you. If Aphrodite is speaking, you should listen. How do you know he's missing? He never misses a rehearsal, unless he's drunk, or with a woman, or a man. <laughs>